Baloo Baloo and welcome. Yes, this video is a day late from my normal upload sch schedule, so there are not, there, there is not a week till Christmas, there are six days. Oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? Are we gonna panic? I hope not. I hope you're ready and if you aren't, I hope you can get ready quick because you know, the malls and stuff like that are going to be filled to the brim with people who haven't gotten ready yet. And I'm not ready, so I mean, if you aren't, we're in the same boat. <laughs> Anyways, today we are making ornaments for the Christmas tree that we made in the last video. And I mean, we're sort of making different kinds of ornaments than maybe you usually see because we're not, well, as we've mentioned quite a lot of, time, lot of times now, we're actually Danish. So we have different traditions and stuff like that. I know that in America you supposedly put a, an angel on top of the tree and maybe also in France, but I'm just saying that because of that Christmas movie with Beauty and the Beast where there's an angel on top of the tree. So I don't know that. Um, I don't even know about England. I actually don't really know. I mean, I love to learn stuff like that. What do you put on top of the tree? And where are you from? I mean, that would be a nice detail too. But uh, we put a star up on the tree and I make it with some of that good old metal just wire, wire that I'm twirling to make it stronger and give it more of a hold. And then I'm using these pipe cleaners with, with some gold on it. Um, to put on top so that it's sparkling, but I really wanted to, to make it uh, three-dimensional so it could, you know, be turned anyway and still look beautiful. So I'm making like two star shapes and putting them together. You will see in the end if you don't get what I'm saying. And my sister is making paper hearts and that's the thing I really 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 don't know if you use in other countries. But basically you, you cut two shapes and I don't even know how to describe that shape. The um, a square with a circle on top, that kind of shape. And then you cut some lines at the bottom of it. It has to be folded over in two and then you, you sort of braid it together and you put a, a holder or a man Oh my gosh, all the English words I have to use. I really don't remember the name. But yeah, uh, just a small strip of paper that can attach to the to the tree. And this actually goes back to, to having an eatable tree, because that's actually tradition that you're supposed to eat the tree once you've, well, danced around it and stuff like that. Um, so it's supposed to have like little little cakes inside but I mean of course these are super small they're normally like the size of a hand or something like that so these are extremely small and also very hard to make but I think we managed to do okay I was getting a little frustrated once I started making them and as you can see my sister is going to make some 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 beads which are supposed to be like Christmas balls? <laughs> I don't know, that sounds really wrong. I don't know if they're called something different. But you know the, the kind of thing you hang on the, on the trees? I've seen those everywhere in all countries, so that's definitely a usual thing. But as you can see, we're just working very hard. And I'm going to go into the reason why this video is a day late. I am literally making this 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 voiceover at almost seven. Seven. What is it called? PM. Oh my gosh! I always know when it's at night time. That's after midnight. I remember it by saying after midnight, pre midnight. So like, it must be PM. Yeah, seven PM. Yeah. In our country, we just use like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-four. And twenty-four is midnight. 
so then it starts over so you know we can always tell the time <laughs> um but yeah the reason this video is late and i'm making this last second and stuff like that it's actually that i've been super busy as you sometimes are during or up to christmas i have been yeah again <laughs> super super busy i've um been preparing like a Christmas lunch, which is also a Danish tradition we do here for almost the entire weekend. I've been making food and just prepping for that. And on Sunday we had the lunch, which also took all day. Um, just people eating and having fun and stuff like that. And the food was so good and we have a lot of lef leftovers. So yes, that's good. We're so happy. <laughs> And um, yeah, after that, which was, uh, you know, yesterday, Monday, we had to go out to look at a house because we are hopefully, I mean, I'm crossing my fingers right now. We are hopefully moving soon. We don't like where we live and we want to move into a house. And oh my God, I have never lived in a house before. And I'm not moving with my sister, just so you know. But yeah, I cannot wait till we get to move. It's gonna be amazing. I hope. <laughs> I mean, who knows, but I hope it will be really, really good for us. Um, so yeah, we were going out to see some houses yesterday. And I mean, the one we were going to look at had been, you know, lying about everything. So that was not a good house. And the other one was sort of improvised, but it took three hours to get there and three hours to get home. So you can imagine I was really tired. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, so I just decided, nope, that's not gonna happen. Um, I'm not gonna edit. I mean, I got home at a time where I could have been editing, but I was like, I'm just gonna eat some food. I'm gonna sit down and I'm gonna watch some TV. I don't care. So I hope you're okay with that. If you aren't, I'm sorry, but that's all I can say. I mean, I don't regret it. And I mean, you still get the video, it's just a day late. So, you know, that's the good thing about not having daily uploads. In theory, we can all, I mean, not always, but we can upload a day late, which is really great. Oh my gosh, my throat is getting sore from talking so much. That's what happens when the videos are 10 minutes long. But I mean, I don't think the next couple will be. This video had like three hours of footage, more than three hours. Which, in I mean, since we have two cameras, the one you can see in frame is my new camera, which I got for my birthday slash Christmas. Um, I'm really happy about that one. <coughs> oh my gosh, excuse me, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, since there are two cameras, we had like, I guess we, it, the project itself took like an hour and a half. Um, and here you can see I'm just wrapping this sort of red wired embellished thing around the tree just a couple of times to, I don't know, give it some shine and color and niceness. And then we're going to attach the rest of the ornaments. And I think I'm like the only one doing it because my sister is working on on this one little little Christmas hat. And look at her hat. Like what is up with that hat? I cannot I can't really look at her because it's like why isn't she picking up her hat? Why isn't she just moving it to the right place? I don't really get it like at all. But here we are attaching the star to the tree. I'm so happy it turned out really, really cute and amazing. And you know, this just overall makes me very happy to look at. And it doesn't take up a lot of space. So it's really cool and good and all of that. If you want to see how we built the tree, tree you can click the annotation. Other than that, bye.